Hello guys, welcome back to Shares Guitar. If you're not subscribed to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and like this video and hit the notification button to be the first person to see my videos. Don't forget to give a comment. Um, today we want to learn the bar chords. We've learned the F. Now we know E, A, D, D minor. A minor, E minor. So we're going to use all these chords to form a bar chord. A bar chord is actually uh, formed when you move a step further away from any open chord. Even the G itself, when I move forward, I have to bar this side. That will give me G sharp, but it's not safe. So let's study with, let's start with A. I move forward. I need A sharp, not this sound. I mean that this side. So what I do is that I'm going to use just the, the one and three fingers. Uh, the index for the first fret. That's when I'm playing A sharp. One movement from A. Then the ring or the finger three will do the will take care of the third fret. But it's not as easy as it seems. Because you have to bend this finger, your finger has to be flexible enough to get there. can play it this way because uh, initially it was index middle ring so I have to replace the the index finger is now going to be the bar so two three four will take place of one two three If you don't understand anything you can leave in the com comment section now E the same way in next finger is going to be bar so when we bar one we have F so this one will be will go to the third string just like the index finger was at the third string so just like this that's the F when you move F sharp G you see G you can get it. it's the same key same chord by a different octave we know C so when we move further, we need to bar this side. So just like this, let's replace this one. So move forward, this one will bar. This is our C sharp. And you can have this D in a C shape. This D we have, you can have it in the C shape. Let's go to D. Uh, D is okay. Let's move to what next? The D minor. The fourth string D 
chord as played from the fourth string. The D minor is supposed to be played the same way from the fourth string. Because you're moving forward, you need to bar that note. So you can play this way if you want. Uh, but I prefer it to be a bar like this is free. Let's go to A minor. If we move forward, we need to bar. So we replace the rest. So that's basically how our uh, F uh, our bar chords are. So in case you are playing in E, uh, E has the E, A, and B. That is the one, four, five. E, A, and B. B is always a bar chord, so you need to use the A bar chord or any way that you want. I use this because when I come here to the this fret, it is shorter that you can't even fix. So I prefer I will encourage you to learn it this way. It's quite tedious. It will take some time. It won't come just in a flash. So you need to practice from time to time. And I and I believe at least within a month you should be getting used to it, getting used to the pain that you never feel the pain anymore. Thank you for watching all the way through and don't forget to give a like if you like this video give a comment if you have any question or anything that baffles you anything that you want me to redo or clarify and don't forget to subscribe see you next time